This is breaking news. American Idol picks top three. Did Alabama's Tristan Harper make it? Sunday's episode of American Idol featured a host of Disney tunes, Katy Perry dressed as Cinderella, and a couple more turns in the spotlight for 15-year-old Alabama singer Tristan Harper. Sadly for Harper's fans, this was the night that his run on Idol came to an end. Despite a couple of solid performances, he didn't pull the viewer votes needed to propel him from the top five into the final three. Still, a top five finish puts him in some pretty rare company. Only a handful of singers from Alabama, Ruben Studdard, Diana DeGarmo, Bo Bice, and Taylor Hicks have done better. What he's saying, first round. Harper's first song choice was almost there from The Princess and the Frog. Celebrity mentor Kane Brown wasn't impressed at first, but pushed Harper sing it in a higher key. Now we just got to make sure that you use your adorableness to win all the ladies over, Brown said, satisfied with the improvement. The two bonded over childhood hardships. Brown said that, like Harper, he'd spend time during childhood when he and his mother had lived out of a car. He is somebody I can look up to, said Harper. Hopefully that'll be me one day. What King Brown said, there's something about him that you can't not like. He's going to be dangerous. He's going to be a star. What Lionel Richie said, Mr. Entertainment himself, you are so comfortable. You make us comfortable. Richie praised Harper's stage moves. The thing about it is, you make the audience love you more when you are just a having fun. What Katy Perry said, you're more than almost there, you're there. What Luke Bryan said, you're such a charmer, you're just a charmer. It was like watching Frank Sinatra up there for a minute. You were directing the horns, I mean, I'm just so proud of the way you're handling this competing and just being yourself and smiling and having fun and do that forever. Please don't change. American Idol contender Tristan Harper gets lost in space during a visit to Disneyland. Disney slash ABC Disney slash ABC. What he's saying, round two. Life is a highway, a Jane Lee Rock tune used in the movie Cars. What Luke Bryan said, life is a highway and you're going to be on a highway in a tour bus. What Lionel Richie said, I discovered something while you were singing that song. You will definitely have, if not dancers, at least one dancer. I saw your mother over there just dancing up a storm. That was amazing. Congratulations, you just took this all the way. What Katy Perry said, I think that was one of your best vocal performances so far that you've given us, hands down. What Ryan Seacrest said, go dogs. What Tristan Harper said, roll tide, the vote. When Sunday's episode came down to its final moments, host Ryan Seacrest didn't draw it out. Will Mosley was the first contender welcome to the top three. Next came A.B. Carter. The third singer picked to advance was Jack Locker. Though the show ended immediately with no analysis of the results that left Harper and Emmy Russell, Aka Loretta Lynn's granddaughter, outside the idol spotlight. What happens next? The show's over for Harper, although nobody will be surprised if he finds a way to capitalize on the exposure he got on his way into American Idol's top five. The show's star-studded, three-hour final airs at 7 p.m. Sunday, May 19, on ABC. Those without basic cable can still live stream new episodes of American Idol on Sundays with Fubo and DirecTV Stream. New episodes become available for streaming on Hulu the day after they premiere. 